Hello from the studios at Pascual Bravo University. I am Gary Vernier and this is Medellin News Report. Medellin authorities are set to demolish the former home of slain drug lord Pablo Escobar amid plans to construct a memorial for the victims of Medellin cartel's violence. The iconic Monaco building, which was the target of a terrorist attack in 1988, will be demolished on Friday, February 22nd, as Mayor Federico Gutierrez outlines plans to remove one of the most visible remnants of the drug lord's reign in the city. According to Gutierrez, the time has come to remove a symbol which represents criminality and shift the focus of attention to the memory of the victims during one of the darkest periods of Medellin's history. Medellin has long battled the legacy left by Escobar with narco tours springing up around the city and programs such as Netflix's Narcos reviving the memory of the drug lord who left thousands of victims. The most important thing is not the demolition, but the memorial which we will build and which will be a tribute to the lives we lost and to those brave people who defended their principles above all else, emphasized the mayor. Charged with the task of designing the memorial to replace the Monaco is Cesar Augusto Zapata, an engineer who worked on the development of the 9-11 memorial in New York, as well as the WIMSA, Women in Military Service, memorial in Washington, D.C. This has been a Medellin News Report. Good day.